Good evening everyone, uh, I'm Matt, one of Viva's clarinetists, uh, and I'm happy to be here this evening bringing you some music from my spare bedroom. Um, so I hope everyone's keeping well, and uh, I've got a good selection of music for you tonight. Uh, being a clarinetist, one of the things I really enjoy about that is the versatility of the instrument. So tonight I'm going to play you three pieces of different genres. Uh, the first on the clarinet is a piece of klezmer music. Uh, now if you don't know about klezmer, it's uh, the traditional Jewish folk music with its roots in Eastern Europe. Um, and it's a very different technique to playing classical style. Um, a lot of bending notes, growling, sighs, fall off notes, um, vibrato, widely used. Um, you'll hear the difference anyway. Uh, so this piece is, it's a Bulgar from Odessa and I'm going to kind of do a um, semi-improvised version. So here we go. change to the bass clarinet. I'll be back soon.
have the bass clarinet. You might not be so familiar with this instrument, you're most likely to see it at the back of an orchestra, although nowadays it's uh, more commonly used as well uh, for solo works in its own right, um, mainly contemporary and jazz. So you play it in the same way as the clarinet, but it sounds an octave lower. So the lowest note on the standard clarinet here, but I can go all the way down to here. <laughs> the first piece I'm going to play is The Elephant by Sansons, which is usually played on a double bass, uh, but I've got an arrangement here by Matt Lax from Symphonia Viva, no less. Usually for bass clarinet and piano, but no piano tonight, so I'm just going to play it on its own. And it works quite well on the bass clarinet, and it's quite a good way to hear what a bass clarinet sounds like. Plenty of low notes in it, and it suits the elephant, really. So here we go. There you go, the elephant. Got to do a little bit of setting up for my next piece because it involves a speaker and a backing track. So I'll just go and do that now and I'll be back in a minute. So I'm back for my last piece of the evening. and This time it's some jazz. It's a piece by Michael Lowenstern, who's an American bass clarinetist and it's called Drift. When he does this piece live, he uses a loop pedal to layer up the music as it goes along, um, but tonight I'll be using a backing track. I'm going to have to trigger it myself and try and get my hand back on the instrument before it's too late, so that could be interesting. Uh, yeah, if you like this piece, go over to Michael Lonestone's website and he's got various albums and other arrangements and things that you can buy from there. Yeah, as I said, it's jazz, so there's uh, some improvising in the middle. A uh, really funky bass line which goes throughout and uh, I hope you've enjoyed this evening. If you're around next Wednesday, um, there'll be another instalment of music from Symphonia Viva.
Thank you, everyone, and have a good evening.